Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we have got right triangle with two given sides. And now I'm going to show you an easy way to find this unknown side. And moreover, we are not supposed to be using calculators of any kind. Please don't forget to give thumbs up to this video. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's the very first thing we are going to do. Let's look at this number 28. 28 could be written as 28 times 101. Likewise, 53, 53 could be written as 53 times 101. And now we can see that we are dealing with a right triangle and we want to find this unknown side. Therefore, we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem. And here's the Pythagorean theorem. A square plus B square equal to C square. Let me go ahead and call this side and A, this side B, and this longest leg is going to be our side C. And now since we want to find the value of A, let me go ahead and move this B square on the right hand side. So A square is going to be equal to C square minus B square. Now let's pretend that our B value is just 28. Let's ignore this 101 and likewise our C value is just 53 and once again we are going to ignore this 101. And now in the next step let's go ahead and fill in the blanks. So A square equal to in our case C is 53 so this is going to become 53 square minus B in our case is 28. So I'm going to say 28 square. And now let's recall this A square minus B square formula. So I can write these numbers as 53 plus 28 times 53 minus 28. So therefore we got A square equal to 53 plus 28 is going to give us 81 and then times 53 minus 28 is going to give us 25. And now let's go ahead and take the square root on both sides on this side and this side as well. So A turns out to be square root of 81 and then I can write square root of 25. I just split them up. So therefore our A value turns out to be a square root of 81 is 9 and square root of 25 is 5. So A turns out to be 45. So thus our this side A turns out to be 45. And now we can see that all these numbers are multiple of 101 as you can see over here. So this number has got to be a multiple of 101 as well. And now if we multiply this 45 times 101 that is going to give us 45, 45 and that is our side A value. So thus our unknown side value turns out to be a 45, 45 and that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.